Hello everybody! I've just had an invite to the Geomine server, and here we are on the uh, newly constructed spawn point. And we're going to have a tour of the server from It's Trebs. Hello hey, everybody. Hey Trebs, how's it uh, going? It's good, it's good. How about you? I am having a wonderful Saturday morning. Yeah. I'm pretty sure it's afternoon for you. Oh well, we've just got the bad weather. Um, bad so, signs, bad what's signs. on the what's on the tour for today? Well, we've got a lot of stuff to show. It's a big server, so. Oh, cool. We'll, first, I'll take you around this new spawner at much too. It's being revamped at the moment, but we'll get as much in as we can. I like the I like the sugar canes. Yeah, just a bit of aesthetics. Pretty nice. Um, yeah, this was only built a few days ago. This is the Nether Hub entrance the portals which we'll go through there later these towers look amazing yeah i think they're inspired by doc m's towers but they're going oh. to hold fans inside them which is okay. they also look good and uh, quite convenient as well i'm not sure if they look better when they're in incomplete or when they're finished <laughs> <laughs> i don't know i don't think either of them are finished completely yet so. the finished one or the unfinished one looks pretty cool yeah i think it's just a lot of tweaking that to be done to them still so Right, and this big monstrosity in front of you is the Ark, and uh, here's some signs okay. just to explain it. This has been here since the server changed wow. map. It's from the old maps. It's where everyone put their chest to bring their goodies from the old map over. But a bit, oh, okay. bit of GMI in history, and it's uh, it's going to stay with us. Nice. And uh, here's just some, yeah, it's from when 1.2 came along, so. And fortunately, the world had to restart, and uh, yeah. So this is a 1.2 map? Yeah, yeah. Okay. It's got all the cool features, and there's a lot of unexplored land, so still lots of emeralds and stuff. Nice. So. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. I'm not, I'm not sure if it's fully work at the moment. You can give it a try if you like. Does it work? I'm somewhere. Oh, yeah. It's worked for me. Is up with the oh those are tripwires yeah. awesome I've never I haven't seen anybody actually build something with tripwires yet no I, this is the first time I've actually been up here so we head over to this wow. tower this one's more complete I think so if it wasn't so glitchy yeah it would be really really cool it's a nice design yeah I've never seen anything like it yeah of course not because we've never had tripwires before. Oh no, there's nothing in here at the moment. I think this is going to have a melon farm, I think, was planned to go in here. Okay. First we'll just head up to this, uh, the Neverwart farm, which is, I think Sean built this. Yeah. It's very, it's another Azuma design, it's quite cool. Oh wow. Just a public it's a farm. Vertical, it's a vertical farm. It looks yeah. pretty cool. It's quite cool, it only takes up a 9x9 nine nine area as well, so. Wow. Nice and compact. I've definitely been considering making one of these. Yeah, I'll I just I'll haven't. Just... Carry. I haven't done anything in my own in my own uh, Nether base yet. Yeah, I was actually going to build this one in the uh, this exact design in the Overworld in my base, but it's getting room for it. I suppose next stop could we could pop by at my base and I could show you around. Uh, we also have Triculux, who is surviving Minecraft on YouTube. We have Rainbow Soup. Um, Doc Redstone also plays here. Quite a lot of members. Zildjian, who's taken under wow. a big operation project at the moment. So yeah, the, here is just some storage for the end farm. I think it's just mainly full of ender pearls. <laughs> uh, we've got a, That's a lot of ender pearls. Yeah, we just end up throwing loads of them away. Here's an enchanting table for after you've done, and then you head down here. It's a very effective end farm, and you can get to level thirty in under two minutes. So yeah, eat quick and easy enchants. Probably just shit. We won't go down there because he homes there at the moment and uh, might mess up. Mess up.
Yeah. Just walk along the sidewalks and smack them to death. Yeah, this is the Doc M style ender form. Yeah. I'm not sure who built this, but it's to come a few changes. It's a nice design, works. Yeah, definitely very cool. I'm gonna have to come along and use it sometime. Okay. Um, and what is this place? This is my base. We'll have a quick look around. Uh, is awesome. Isn't much here at the moment. It's a bit of a work in progress, but we've got a few things to show. Wow. But the yeah, the the ceiling is going to come out very dark in the video. I know that. Yeah, it is. I saw it on Zuljian's episode. Yeah. This it, we're gonna. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with the ceiling yet. So. I might extend it all the way up to the surface this room, just give it a nice tower, or I might put a nice sandstone roof, I'm not too sure. I'll... A tower up to the sky block would look amazing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the only thing is, it's quite a big room, we don't know what to fill it with, I'm struggling to fill this one. But yeah. The... Glass. Fill it with glass. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The aim for this build was to bring nature inside, which I thought was quite a cool idea, so... Uh... Oh, wow. I've, up top is a jungle biome, so down here we get this nice luscious green grass, and I've sheared a few ferns, which was Zildjian's idea. And oh, the ferns are nice. A few flowers just to brighten this place up. And I didn't realize it, but I'm still recording in uh, in the default texture pack. Oh, that's fine. I've When I build, I usually keep it. So it would look nice and default, and uh, it's what a lot of GMI members do. So I use Faithful, which is just the, the more is defined. Is that 32 or 64? I use a 32 version. Oh. I actually yeah, use I was... Doc M's uh, little tweaks in it as well. So. Oh, Doc M's Faithful. That one's cool. Yeah. Um, I've been suggested to use the Faithful 64 for this series. Yeah. So I think that's what I'm going to try and do. Yeah, definitely, because uh, when people are building a... a, a a different texture pack can really change what it was supposed to look like. And uh, <laughs> yeah. I know that. Down here is this little I... lava pit, and um, the portal isn't going to stay over there. We're going to have them over here. You're going to move it over here. Yeah, but I need. I'll put it in. The... <laughs> it's not. There's going to be a glass like layer above this, but I need to fill out the lava so it's like an infinite pool looking thing, and then the portal is going to be on the back wall, which would be quite nice. Yeah, I really wish lava would actually create more source blocks yeah, but it doesn't. It's taking time, it's kinda of boring as well. <laughs> Trips back and forward to another. Uh, so you said we had some farms down here? Uh we have some farms if we go this direction. Um I don't know if you noticed the big balconies which are quite cool when you get top and look over. Oh wow. Yeah. Yeah and then we head through here which is like a a subsection of the main base and it splits off into three different ways but <laughs> here <laughs> here we have a wheat farm which I haven't replanted recently so uh, no wheat will fall from there at the moment if we come down here we have some hidden chests which I quite like oh nice it's just, it's <laughs> That's switch. Cool. It's just a switch um, connected to two sticky pistons but to me, this was this was amazing, and it's the same with this one. But on the inside of here, we have a crafting bench and a furnace. Oh, so. wow, cool! Yeah, uh, we can head up to the melon and pumpkin farms now. Great. Um, I don't know if you noticed, but the half slabs on the ceiling have uh, torches on the oh, wow. upper side of them, so it gives off quite a nice a glowing effect from through the stone has that slabs. Fluorescent. Yeah, and a lot of the floors half slabbed throughout or stairs, so you won't get any mobs spawning in dark patches. Awesome. Come through here, we just have some sliding doors, and uh, we have a uh, melon farm on the left hand side with ice blocks so they come faster. However, I need to sort out these wart flows, uh, but I'm still stocked up melon. And here is a pumpkin farm, which is the same. Same design, but obviously just different seeds. And the water is... It's a bit buggy at the moment, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alright. This looks cool. 
I like what you what you're doing with the wall here. Yeah, I, I, I didn't want it to be the same on both sides because I don't know I like things a bit quirky, so I tried this <laughs> out. And it's quite nice. That's cool. This, this tunnel is actually going to extend and turn round, but I still need to finish that. Make a big circle. Yeah, I was thinking something like that with just all the farms on this side in this little main section will be this is just going to hold all the farms so never walk farms and i've got my wheat farms we also have a ravine in in my base which is just Under directly underneath it an underground ravine yeah it's quite cool and uh me and ehone who you may have just saw in the chat there are going to turn into an npc village so an npc quite nice under idea. underground village yeah that sounds pretty cool um, I think you can actually see it through. Yeah, you can see it through the glass. Um, not sure, but I think you have to have direct light shining on the houses. Yeah, we'll have to have some light down there anyway, because when you're down there, you get void fog as well. So. Oh, that's a pretty deep ravine. Hey, there yeah, he's actually down there. There he goes. <laughs> we we started this today, and all we've we've just tied it up and put some grass in. So. <laughs> nice. A lot of progress made. And then through here. We, there isn't actually any farms through here yet, but I'm thinking animal farms in the centre with uh, cobblestone generators and obsidian generators, etc. off to the side with uh, brewing rooms as well, possibly. Okay. Very cool. And here we are. Okay, what is this place? This is H2211's base. Uh, just known on the server as H, and... Uh, He's the mob science genius on the server, so okay. he has a really, really nice mob farm here, which you can see. Wow, that is strange looking. Yeah, but super effective, and it's where a lot of the people who want the mob resources come, so. So this is where to get all your mob drops. Yeah. Nice. It's, it's it's a good design. It also you can turn into a water catcher, which can get your XP, or you can just turn it so you get your drops, and then the light switch on and off. And okay. Basically, how you use this thing is um, you put a minecart on the track, and you will keep riding round and round, which will like activates all the spawning of the mobs, and then once every five minutes, I don't know how he's managed to do it, but you'll come down and collect the drops from down here. And while we were out touring around, False Symmetry popped in and decided to join us. So here's False Symmetry showing us around her base. Okay. Go. <laughs> <laughs> so what is this place? Where are we now? Okay, well this um, is uh, my base. Uh, and full symmetry on the server, and yeah, I haven't done much yet, but yeah, I'll give you a quick tour. It looks cool from up here. Yeah, it looks quite kind of cool. Yeah, it's not too yeah. bad. I really uh, like this shape. Yeah, it's a good size as well. Not not too big, not too small. I think it's, it's good. Okay. Show us the way. So, how uh, do we, how do we where do you want to go? Uh, if you over this way. I mean, there's this bit up here is all temporary. It's all going to be kind of down here in the end. Like, I need to move my portal down and everything. But, um, yeah. If you just uh, jump down there, it's water thing. Um, and yeah, this, I haven't really done much to this yet. It's kind of just a, uh, I've been planning out with dirt. Oh, that's, yeah, I do that a lot. I yeah. lay everything out with dirt. Yeah, well, uh, these sorry, um, these circles are going to be kind of where there's going to be like a hole, and then the rest is going to be filled in with like wood or sandstone or something. So oh, this nice. is where the floor is going to be. Then. So you'll be able to see kind of straight down cool. through the floors in the middle. Yeah, I was going to say nice circles. <laughs> yeah, they're not too bad because I mean they can look kind of weird in Minecraft sometimes, but mm. <laughs> yeah, especially when they're smaller. Mhm. Mm yeah. Oh boy. Yeah, so uh, this bit's just going to be natural, kind of, trees and things. Oh, cool. maybe, maybe with, like, a little pumpkin farm and melon farm, kind of natural-looking, kind of not too much redstone kind of thing. Nice. Just uh, simple. Um, yeah, I'm, uh, by the way, I'm going to be getting rid of these 
vines at the moment. Oh. They're they're, uh, they're just growing there because I want some. I want to collect it's some. It's a vine farm. Yeah, <laughs> kind of a <laughs> roughly yeah. Oh, this hall looks yeah, so cool. If I, I like the arches. Yeah, I'm kind of trying to keep all the halls the, the same in this area at the moment. Kind of keep the theme going through. Um, so yeah, this is the first thing I did when I chose this base. Like, I dug it all out and everything, and then I decided I wanted a zombie XP farm. So this is my first thing I've built. Oh, wow. You turn it off and, uh, yeah. They're quite loud, but um, it's, it's quite good. I mean, since uh, 1.3, with when you uh, only enchant up to one uh, level 30, it's, it's quite good. So yeah. Yeah, and I like the reduced, the reduced experience requirement in 1.3. Yeah, yeah, it's a lot better, especially at the end farm here. It's uh, like so much quicker. <laughs> my own. But, um, yeah, they, they My own single player only has a, uh, a skeleton, skeleton farm to go off of. Yeah. Well, I mean, I haven't found any... Well, I found other spawners, but they're all quite far away, so... Oh. I, don't, I don't know what I'm doing with them yet. But um, one of them should fall down in a moment. But, oh, uh, it transports them all the way over here? Yeah, uh, no, um, it... There's a water elevator, like, behind this block here. Mm -hmm. And it goes down and then drops them 22 blocks or 23 blocks, whatever oh, it is. Oh, this is your dropper. And then you can... Okay. Yeah, and then you can hit them twice and they should, uh... Should die. Nice. So yeah, it's not too bad. It's a bit basic, but yeah. It's still pretty Does cool. Does its job. Yeah, I think, I think it's alright. I'm not great with redstone and that, so <laughs> kind of just, you know, basic. Yep. <laughs> well, yeah, um, anyway, this is my wheat farm. Cool. Uh, it's kind of. Still work in progress, like on the sides. You can see kind of two different chest kind of spaces, oh. like where the chests are. Um, oh. They're two different designs. I've been working on that at the moment. I'm not really liking either of them, to be honest. <laughs> but, uh, this one's like too busy, and the other one's like too plain. So I don't know. I need to find a balance, really. I actually like this one. Yeah, it's not. It's not too bad, but I don't know. It seems like it needs something else. I would say throw some vines on it. Like what you've got yeah, on the other side. Like, yeah. But could do. Or hmm, da, 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 da. I do like this water leaf thing that you've got going. Mm hmm Yeah. Okay, that's cool. Yeah. Um And you're using anyway, the yeah. new logs, that's cool. Uh huh. Yeah, I like these. I was just checking. Ah, the wheat farm's all grown, so uh if you wanna do you wanna pop pop up here and have a look? Sure. Um, yeah, it's quite basic. Oh, wow. I mean, I kind of designed it in creative, but it's, yeah. You can't actually, because I, I didn't realize that dispensers kind of got rid of the seeds that were right opposite them. Like, you, you can't harvest anything from, from those squares, so. Oh, you've got water dispensers. Yeah, it destroys them, so oh, I didn't realize that. I'd never yeah. even thought of doing that. No, it's quite, it's quite cool, but it goes up about, I think, seven levels. It's all the same. Wow. But yeah, yeah um, this is this is all new 1.3 stuff. Yeah, I kind of wanted to do something with the dispensers because it's quite a good, cool idea. But um, I'm, yeah, uh, it's all done. So yeah, I'm used to seeing uh, the water flows con controlled with pistons. Mm, yeah, well, uh, you can press the button if you like. Cause it's all awesome. grown. Great. So go for it. Yeah, this <laughs> is my first day on the server, and I I've been getting gift items like crazy. Yeah. Well, you'll get quite a lot of seeds from this and that, so uh, you can feel free to put them in a chest if you don't want them all. I don't uh, even have. You can a, take. I don't even have a chest yet. Um, you don't even have a chest. I don't even have a chest yet. <laughs> I did fill okay. up the Ender chest, but it's full of melons. Yeah. <laughs> there are a lot of melons on the server everywhere. <laughs> I think I'm filled up. Uh, mm. Yeah, that's right. Wow. You can. Uh, you can um, there, I have don't a spare chest. Again, I'll just be here. Oh wow. <laughs> Have you come free yet? Cause I, it's lagging like crazy. Yeah, <laughs> I can okay, I can yeah. see something, yeah. but yeah, I don't know how the lags. I see you guys. Yeah, um... So yeah, we've just arrived at Rainbow Soup's main base now, which is. Oh, can I uh, point out quickly? Uh, all of these cocoa bean 
plant things. Um, they're the prank thing that I did. Oh. So ignore those. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's quite I, cool. I did it in this area and like a couple of others. Nice. But, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, a lot of pranking on is, this. Uh, is your way. video going to be out today? Uh, no, it will. I don't know. You can you can uh, put it out whenever you want. It's, oh wow, anyway, this yeah. is really cool. Uh, you know, most... the gold. Oh. Yeah, the gold looks really good actually, doesn't it? Yeah. It's a most, cool idea. Most of the subs that I've gotten while I was gone were for other video games. Oh, okay. And yeah. So it's the Minecraft guys that aren't really watching much anymore. Okay, well, I'll be sure to send some over your way. Not that I have a lot either, but <laughs> you'll get like two or something. So, yeah. Um, so, are you going to show him Trebs around? Or uh, do you want me we'll to? Just, we'll, I'll just chip in when I can, but you can do the most okay. of it. I haven't really been here. I've, I've been recording the whole time, so. Okay, well, I get lost in this base, by the way, so <laughs> if I don't know where <laughs> I am, then. Uh... It's un yeah, it's definitely pretty cool looking. Yeah, this is yeah. this is a cool. I like this. I like this bit. To be honest, the cocoa beans look quite nice because it gives off that glowing effect. Yeah, they look. They're kind of interesting, aren't they? Like, yeah. Maybe not so many of them, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Few some now and again here might look alright. Yeah, we'll just head down here. Oh wow! Oh, this is really cool. This is very yeah. cool. These water Double streams are shown in a uh, like a so. I don't know if you watched Sokar, but he had that going through one of his tunnels. Uh, okay, cool. Oh, this is really nice. It's just the small yeah, details so... that really make this quite cool. Yeah. I really like these archways, actually. Like, he changed this up quite a bit since uh, he first... Because he first had, like, a little bit of writing or something up there with wall or something. Oh, yeah. He's he's cha he's ch he changed RS. it for arches, and it looked really good. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, here's your little prank. Uh... Mission. Yeah, that's my little signs that I put there. So I thought you'd a leave. Prank is a did... prank unless you put up a sign. Yeah. I couldn't think of anything funny to put though, so I just put that. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I don't know. I thought you can make you make chocolate out of cocoa beans, so you know. Cookies. Yeah. Well... Would have would have been good to do this to Berg because he's Belgian, so. <laughs> yeah. Could have done. Yeah. Um. So yeah, I think we'll just head this way. He's got some different floors, like you can go down further. Yeah. Can easily get lost in this place. Yeah. Oh, this, this, oh, is, where, where, this is Yeah, I put them up there, there as well. <laughs> <laughs> but, Anywhere uh, this there's actually... jungle wood, gotta put it. Yeah, but this doesn't need anywhere, because I actually checked and I dug through and there's just water on the other side. So yeah, uh, maybe he's planning to put something there. He's planning a room there, but um, okay. nothing there at the moment. This there is actually a way down over here, if you come this way. It's all to drop. Oh. Whee! This is cool. Yeah. And that's where you can, like, see through to, to this bit. Oh, wow. This mossy, smooth stone stuff. Yeah, it's stone got quite brick. a lot. This looks nice. Oh, this is amazing. This looks yeah. awesome. It, it looks a lot better without the cocoa beans on it, but... Yeah. <laughs> Spoiling this base. It's a cool room, actually. Yeah, I know I've spoiled mm. it for the tour. <laughs> well, through this waterfall, we have so. some storage, storage room. Yeah. yeah, on this yeah. side, it's a, finish, a finished one on this side. Oh, we'll check out the other side. Yeah. It's oh, a really nice. cool idea, actually. I like the way he's put leaves and that. Oh, wow. Water. That's really cool. I'm not sure if I'll turn it off again. It. Yeah, I'm going to turn it off. <laughs> right, Eddie Wolf, watch watching? the magic. Watch the magic. Okay, hang on. Oh. You missed it. <laughs> oh. I if you want to go up, you press the button, and I think we pressed it twice. Oh, there. Okay, um... um. Did I lose you guys? Uh, no, we're still here. Um, just go up here. I think I lost Trebs. What, in the call? Yeah. Ah, uh, okay. Um, Apparently Azuma is... is streaming right now. 
he he does sometimes like randomly. He'll just like announce it quickly and then <laughs> stream. I have not even tried to stream yeah. yet. No, this I've, is kind of interesting. Yeah, I sometimes modern assume he streams, but he keeps like doing random ones that I'm never there for. <laughs> um, I can't I can't remember how you get to his house up there. Like if you look through the water. Yeah, I don't know how we got. Up. Oh, maybe maybe it's this way actually. If you uh, come over here, yeah. Water, nice. Yeah, it's got like a little house thing up here, which looks pretty cool. Wow, kind of Asian style. Yeah, it's, it's like a. Uh, I can't remember the name of it, but it's pretty cool, yeah. Yeah, I don't know the names of any Asian buildings, just... Yeah. Well, I did, I did know it, but it's just gone. <laughs> Forgotten. But yeah, it's a pretty you, you cool You didn't design. get the cocoa beans on this one. No, I, I couldn't figure out how to get up here, so... <laughs> <laughs> now uh, you know. Yeah. I can always come back again. <laughs> but yeah, he's got tree farms over there. Which I think I assume is design, actually. Oh, yeah. It looks like a modified version, though. Okay! What is this place? This is Panzan. <laughs> um, oh, like can we do that park. again? Yeah. Without the burping? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna start up Fraps. No burping. You're gonna start Fraps? Yeah, I haven't got it up. Oh, nice. You're gonna record me. Yeah. Let me strip that. <laughs> I gotta show off my awesome skin. And me with my Taliban skin. <laughs> and, yeah. Uh, and false Actually, investigation. Am I Steve still? Yeah, you're Steve. Oh, am, I, am, I Steve for every, am I Steve for everyone? No, you're, nope. you're fine for yeah, me. You're fine for me as well. Oh, okay. Whoa! <laughs> Psycho. Psycho. Strip mini. There we go. <laughs> Me and my casual Strip skin. Bitch. <laughs> oh, yeah. So you got your fraps running? Yeah. Okay. Let's record the, the intro again. So, what is this place? This is Pantsland. Pants, Pantsland? Oh. The home of fun <laughs> and games. Oh. Okay. This is not in any way related to Goodland or inspired by it at all. <laughs> <laughs> Right. Right. Sure. So, just pointing out, this is my first time here as well, Wolf. So, Rainbow Fighter. So, this is a game is by Darkism and Rooster HD. So, I'm not quite sure what we have to do. Oh, okay. I, I guess you squish each other. Someone, someone wolf, needs to go so. on the other side, don't they? Yeah, I'm just gonna. I'll drop my stuff in here and then I'll beast oh, you over. Take my stuff out quickly. My bags in this bed. Come join me, Wolf. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. All right. okay, Bounce cool. on him while he's asleep. Alright, let's Down go to the I need to quickly set that spawn. There, there are a couple of empty drop, ones. Drop your stuff off in the chest just in case. I think I'll put mine in this second. What are you doing? What are you doing? No! <laughs> Breaking my bed. I've seen what would happen if he was asleep when I'd do it. I'd probably walk around laying down. Oh. Okay. That'd be great. Right, let's go. Let's go play some Rainbow Fighter. Right, would have been good if we had some rules. Oh, hit buttons <laughs> to kill the opponent. Right, me and False will go on this side. Okay, I I'll run back then. I was trying to find a free chest, but there are none. Oh, you can put your stuff in the chest, Wolf, in case you die. I filled the chest. Oh, okay. <laughs> so yeah, so. I you can't you press the Ow, button and walk. Oh, you press the button and walk all in one. Yeah, well done. I have right. no idea what we're doing. What? Oh, when I, you I press actually... the button, yeah, we have to kill each other by doing that. Oh no! I, I, I am. I am <laughs> outside for some reason. What? You glitched. <laughs> Lol. Yeah. Unlucky. One v two it is. Oh. <laughs> that, that means oh. I win. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna kill Wolf. I will kill him. But not before I kill you. <laughs> no! Oh. Yes! Back in. 
One down. Oh, come on, false. Ah! No, no oh, cheating. Thanks for your food. Why am I picking up stuff? Because I dropped oh, okay. it. Okay. Ah. <laughs> I'm gonna die already. I'm gonna die. Oh no. Oh, oh, oh no. Picked up a strategy. Oh. Ah. Damn it. Game over. Come on, folks. No. Do us proud. Can I, can I have my stuff back? Maybe? Yeah, one second. Let me kill folks. Hey, let let him fin finish his game. It's quite a good idea for a game. Oh. I think I might die. One yeah, heart left. Oh. And. Oh, yeah. <laughs> one. Kill him. <sighs> He's dead. <laughs> Oh, um, on my screen, you, you, you're still like. Ah. Uh, well. Indeed. <laughs> and back through the portal. Oh, when I. Back through the portal. <laughs> okay, so this has been a wonderful tour of. Where are we again? Oh, yeah, Geomine. Geomine. <laughs> And since I've told yeah. people that I'm recording, they're all showing up to say hi. Yeah. <laughs> yep. And in the background, you can see the huge spawn towers. Awesome. So, we've had a tour from False Symmetry, It's Trebits, and Mini Red. <laughs> Hello. It's Trebs. Trebs. I don't know why I want to call it Trebits. <laughs> I'll be Trebits. Trebit? Trebit? <laughs> <laughs> like a frog. So this is my new my new home for a while, guys. Look forward to well, a, your new homies. Look, look forward to a new series for me in the next few days. And uh, this is one wolf saying, "Have a good night." Good night. Good night. Bye. Good night. Bye. I love you. <laughs> it's raining endophiles. Huh? Bye. Cut. There. Yeah. I thought that was good enough. Now, how Whoever. many people turned up? Oh, there's a lot of people here. Okay, that's it. We're out. Uh, we are out. <laughs>